seen that video? And be like, oh yeah, you're the dude that did the. Oh, outside of the gate, growling. Did you ever check out that video he was referring to? The, which one? The one about him the growling? Growl, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. All the original? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know which one he's talking about. And now I'm outside the gate. Sense? Yeah, it makes sense. Yeah, because in the video he was like, get your money, I'm not your funny. See, I thought you did him dirty because I thought you were going to play the video after. No, no. No <laughs> context for the no context for the audience. It's a, if you know, you know. Now I'm on the gate growling. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he, he ain't allowed in. That's why he's on the other side. Hey, yo. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a untamed dude. Wait, we're on the inside. We're the ones caged. What is this, Tom and Jerry? That just confused me. Oh, what's the date and time, Abe? What? What, what, what's the day and what's the time? Today is Saturday. I was on the gate like this. T minus 30 seconds till opening. We got resellers camped at the... Oh, we got Froze on here. Froze on your lot and the rest of you must wait 30 seconds. Uh, now I'm outside of the gate growling. Please don't do that. Uh, ten fifty. Can you just touch me? <laughs> That's assault. <laughs> assault. Definitely uh, not allowed in now. September second, the second of the month. It's actually Nakeem's. Uh... Oh, did I just see your government? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, dude. I don't care. Oh, it's eleven. Welcome in, guys. We're officially open. I should have barrel rolled into the store. That would be crazy. I should have did it. That would be your second highlight. Should I have did it? Let's just cut that part, and you can do it. We're gonna cut that part. Nah, nah, nah. Just, you're good. You're good. You're good. Something would have went wrong. Then we have maybe two. They're only after you. Jump those up real quick. Yeah, we got three. Yeah. Probably. I mean, those big sucks. Like, turn that belt just jump. I would. Like, in the moment of me talking to Keem before we open, like, it was at like 2.20, yeah. and now it's at 2.30. I already have an eight. Uh, wait. Is this? Look at the dress. Y'all see the color coordination? That, that's how, y'all see this? That's how you lean when you got some on. <laughs> That ain't a regular lean. <laughs> that's, that's a lean, and you got some on. He <laughs> said, I know I got that shit on. <laughs> nah, I figured it was, it was a little cool in here, by the way. So, rock out some pants. Like 75 or something. I guess I, I hadn't worn these in so long. I kind of forgot I had these. We have Palomino, nine and a half. He called, got quoted. This is a very nice shoe, in my opinion. It's not a mocha, but my thought process behind this is I can destroy this shoe and not feel bad. I have a halfway beat mocha, I have a DS mocha. I can grab one of these for 200 bucks and I can run this into the ground for the next two months and not feel bad about it. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get a 10 probably this week and then I'm just gonna wear it. Whoa, Connor's buying a shoe? I don't know if you guys remember, but he's been on a quest to actually downsize, not add to. Three shoes in the last week. That's crazy. 81, 20, 40, 60, 80, 2, 5. Appreciate it, man. Have a good one, I sold three shoes this week, one of which being a cactus plant. Huh? Whoa, finally, the cactus plant. That's crazy. 68.50. Good stuff, man. That's a good one. Connor's up this week. I'm up this week. Next week, I, and I paid rent this morning, so I'm still down. But, you know, it's all right. If I get all you do is. Capturing you eating some popcorn, dog. How's it going today, man? I actually haven't talked to you yet. I haven't talked to you yet, Gio. Everything's good. It is Saturday. It's actually Labor Day weekend. Um, I don't think it's going to be a super crazy day. Today's the first day of college football, the first full week of college football. And there's a game here in Charlotte. I think people will come in, try to get some fits. I've already talked to a couple people on the phone that said they're looking for a couple of stuff for the game tonight. It should be a good Saturday. He gets to go home early. Absolutely not. Abe just had the last two days off. Yeah, Abe's not going home early. <laughs> um, 
Um, kind of where were you standing? What did you have in mind that you were looking to get value-wise? Too bad, I wouldn't really try to get a minute to get a for here. I got you. Um, I probably wouldn't be able to do an even swap today. Both of these undercover Sakai's, they're not doing very well. Right, they're right, right, under right, retail, right. brand new. I would be at 50 bucks a piece on these. And then Pollens, the last pair I had, I sold it for 100 bucks. I would do the same one for this. This one would be 50 bucks as well. So it would be 150 for the three shoes with them being okay. free owned. Um, I believe we have these at 280, so I'd leave you a difference of 130 if you wanted to do that. Yeah, I can do that. Do you want to try these on real quick while you're here? Yeah, sure. And we need to attend. What's the place that, the best place to get like jerseys in the mall? Uh, Lids Locker Room. So it's yeah. on this floor. It's right down by Dillard's, right okay, there. Right, right, it's uh, right past the bar shop. Hey, I appreciate it, bro. Of course, have a, great have a good one. All right, guys, we are here with a familiar face. If you remember, we saw him at Sneaker Exit in like one of our earliest first videos. First or second video. Here is our guy, Sandal Sneakers. He just came by. This is Mr. Sandal Sneakers. He came in earlier. He, uh, he had some Palominos earlier. He asked if we were taking Yeezy slides. We're taking Yeezy slides, even though they all look the same. $90 a piece, five. Five pairs, um, so we'll get them all paid out. He has a nice little feature again. It's good to see him. We see him every couple of weeks, and then 450. Let's get him paid out. 40, 40, 50. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you, man. I'll see you soon. I'll see you at the event. Yes, sir. He's a mirror, just need a quick little touch up, you know. It doesn't smell like money. It smells like it smells like El Paso, Texas, baby. The taco, uh, the taco season. Why gotta be El Paso? Bro, that's the brand, bro. The name brand is El Paso. The Texas little the seasoning for your taco meat. What, 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 what season do you put on your taco meat? Great value. <laughs> See, he's down to earth. I ain't gonna lie. That little brand be hitting. Nah, I use the El Paso, the big one. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Crazy. What is the motion too? And then he did it again. <laughs> we work with children, Gio. <laughs> children. Easter five just walked in the door. It's a good shoe. I like the shoe. Unfortunately, it's not worth a ton of money nowadays, but it is a nice shoe. It does well for us. Did you have a number in mind that you were looking to get? I got you. Let me kind of see where market has settled. I'd be at 190. 190? Yes, sir. Is there any wiggle room with that? Um, I'd be able to do more in store credit if you wanted. It'd be 210 store credit, but cash would be 190. 190? Yes, sir. Okay. Can I walk around? See what you guys of course. Got? More than welcome to. Um, my name's Connor. If you have any questions, let me know. 20, 40, 60, 80, 40, 20, 40, 40, 60, 80, 90. There you are. And if you're ever looking to sell anything, that's just an iPhone. You can text, call that number, okay. um, and we'll get back to you. And if it's brand new, we can give you a quote over the phone before you even get here. What's up? What's up? What's good, Gio? How you been? Mr. Luna, Mr. Y Luna. Y'all was getting me when I'm wearing, like, you know, GRs going on. Nothing too crazy. You know, a little, little casino action. But... Get me next time that I'm actually wearing some heat, Gio. But talking about heat, check this out. Come on, come on. I'm following you, dog. Come on. Lead the way. Yeah, this is some fire. So if you guys are able to get your hands on this pair, it's gonna go up. That That's your tip of the day right there. Is that your prediction, dog? Yep. It's going up? That's definitely my prediction. Just details Buy on now. it's crazy. Buy now, don't wait till later. Pink, brown lace. Great fall shoe. I see it being a five, six hundred dollar shoe. Yeah, the Give Utah is crazy. Two. Yep. Bro, I'm so mad, bro. Why? We had this shoe in a ten. Real ones know. If you who EYBL. Any GT Cut one is hard to find, but the EYBL is like you got you're not finding it. But we had my size in the shoe, what like six months ago, and I should have jumped on it because I'm literally never gonna see that shoe again. And now we have a size eight, so. Tears. I do have a GT Cut one though. I will say I have the mango color, so it's like a purple and like orange. But 
the CYBL just hits different. The details in the back, like, so an EYBL for like people who don't know, it's a elite youth basketball league that Nike does. So they do it for like the most hype, you know, more like kind of like the mainstream play people you'll see on like Instagram, on you know YouTube, Ball is Life, Hoop Mixtape, all that. So steppers, man, we got it all here at SP, even for the hoopers. Connor, 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 Connor. Yo, Gio, Midday Gio. report. Midday report. It's actually been a very good day. I underestimated what it would be. There's a lot of people out. I don't even think it's like back school shopping. I think people are just outside. Uh, good week. Good day so far. I'm, Matt, Matt, I'm, Matt. Midday report. I'm here, man. I'm living life. I like pie. I love pie. Like that is. If, all right. Listen here, you two. If you ever want to bring me a dessert. Even do that. Ten dollars store credit for anybody can tell you what show that's from. I guarantee nobody gets. I don't know what it is, but if you ever want to bring me something, you can bring me a pie, preferably like a chocolate mousse pie, something along those lines. <laughs> I like, like apple pie and stuff like that. Cobblers, I'm all. That's all in the same family. I'm all for that. But if you want to bring me a pie, please. Come on. I love it, man. Yeah, ten dollars store credit. Anybody can tell me where the phrase "I like pie" came from. What TV show? Shout out to Andy, man. He's the only one that brings us stuff. Yeah, Andy. Yeah, yeah. Andy, the goat. Hey, man. I know. Connor Connor said bring him pie, don't bring him nothing. Bring me a strawberry cheesecake. <laughs> Two eighty. Two eighty for both. No, 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 not for both. Like, it's like three fifty. Yeah. yeah. Um, on these with no box, realistically, I'm probably going to be at like one thirty. On the yellow, the taxi. I mean, let me look into this. I can buy a new pair of these at like one fifty. Um, if I was to buy this one in this condition, I'd probably buy it like seventy dollars. I mean, I, I was thinking about like, yeah, you want to look crazy? At least three. Two eight. Three will probably be a little high for me. Like I said, like I can buy new new pairs of these at like one fifty. Yeah. Um, and these, if I had an original box, I could do a little bit more. Yeah. But without the original box, that's kind of where I would be at. Yeah, man, that's cool. It's cool. It's cool then. I right, appreciate you, man. Hold on to him. Yeah, we get you back. Yeah. We got a DM yesterday, so we worked out one of the pairs before they came in. This is a seven and a half in the University of Four. Um, four hundred on these. Anything brand new, as you guys know, we can always quote over DMs, text calls before you get here, make it easy for you. The other two, these are like more in one pair, so we're gonna take a look at them. We have a midnight baby, and this is looks to be a playoff twelve. Did you have a number in mind? Did you know kind of what you were looking for, roughly? I got it. No worries. Let me take a look at this one. It's going to be 20378 today. Um, so for the Midnight Navy Fours, I was, I'd be at 150 on them. Um, since they are used, I'd probably sell them right at 200, to be honest with you. But not even the playoffs. are brand new. They're only at like 180. Yeah. Not super high. So this one, I'd probably be at 80. I'll sell this at about 120, 130 in the store. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Thank you. Perfect. Unbelievably nice. So nice. Unbelievably nice. So people like that make the job much more bearable. Customer service can uh, and retail is mentally draining. People like that make this job fun and worthwhile. So hopefully she comes back again soon. If you were seven and a half in a playoff, this is literally worn half the time. We'll probably be selling this at like 120, 130 bucks. Get at a super good deal. OG all. Um, 
And then this is just not this shoe kind of blows my mind. It is undefeated how expensive this shoe is. Um, seven and a half, really good size. Not a size we see a lot of anymore in this shoe. As we were talking with her, she's a Duke fan, so she doesn't even really like this shoe. But we have a lot of Carolina fans here in North Carolina, obviously, especially here in the Charlotte area. You're seven and a half, and you've been looking for this shoe for a little while. You know where to find it. As you guys know, Palomino's release day. Um, already mentioned how good this shoe is. G I know Gio doesn't like the shoe because of this. I don't. I don't, man. That's not a deal breaker to me. Like, is it unfortunate that it's not white or this sail color? Or brown. Like, sail, white, or brown would have been fine. It should have been this. That would have been hard. That would have been crazy, yeah. That would have been hard. Um, but it's still a really good shoe. I mean, for 200 if you're buying it off somebody else, for like 230 240 bucks it's a really good shoe even if you get it from us from 275 300 it's still a really good shoe i'll be honest with you um the leather quality it's not the best but that's okay is i think durability will be good on this um the suede new buck material that they use it's not like crazy soft like it was on the mochas the leather on the mocha is also really soft um this is more durable in my eyes which makes it more fun to wear because you don't have to worry about wearing it I sell a lot of these. I don't. I, me personally, I sold the Moon Gray today. How much was that? He, he, put it, he put it work on that sale. <laughs> Matt earned that one. He put it work on that sale. <laughs> I mean, $450 for a car, man. $450 for Like, the shoe is worth that much. Like, don't get me wrong. The shoe is worth a lot of money, but I, it takes foam. It goes for that much. Is it worth that much? I think that's my favorite foam. Right? But is it worth it? Goes or worth? I, I believe it's worth what I pay that. No. But I do think it's worth that, yeah. Who has it? Nobody I think has that's it. a weird argument. Would I pay that? But is it worth it? So it's not worth it to you then. Huh? You wouldn't pay that, so therefore it's not worth it to you. It's not worth it to me, but the, the, the value of the shoe is worth the price. <laughs> There's a lot of shoes that I feel like are worth the money, but I wouldn't pay for it. Man, that's a real philosophical okay, question. Tell us in the comments below. What was the question? He said, he said, I wouldn't buy it, but I think it's worth it. I said, but then wouldn't that make it not worth it to you, though? It's not worth it to me, but I think the, the, the price matches the value of the shoe. Because who has that shoe? That's true. But Jaden also makes a pretty do, solid point. Like if the shoe's worth that, you would pay it's it. It's worth it, you would. Close to the end of the day. Two more hours remaining. We almost there, man. How do you feel? Feel great. How's the energy levels? We're running on fumes. I'm still waiting on that Red Bull sponsorship. I'm it's no, coming, bro. I don't know where the fridge is. It's at. in the works. I think it got lost in the mail. I need that. <laughs> what is going on, guys? I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, it was Palomino Day, so you saw a couple of buys. There wasn't a ton around, so we bought what we could. Um, lots of selling, lots of trading, lots of buying as always. You probably saw a lot of other cool things that walked in the store. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Remember, follow us on all of our social media, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook. And as always, everything is always available here on our website, soulpriorities.com, over 24-7. Have it shipped directly to the house. Thank you guys for sticking with us. We'll see you on the next one.